see what this man, this man right here, does for a living. Brock Enright is an artist and a professional kidnapper. People pay him up to $1,500. And look how sweet this guy looks. Up to $1,500 to be abducted, and he plans and often videotapes the entire thing. Take a look at this kidnapping. Here we go. Bizarre. Please welcome Brock Enright, professional kidnapper. Welcome, Brock. Hello. So let's start off with that videotape right there. Yeah, that's some woman that came to you and asked to be kidnapped? Yes. Why? <laughs> um, for the experience, I guess. Oh, really? Yeah. So if I want to experience death, will you kill me? <laughs> uh, no, no, no. I, that's, that's what I How did want. you come up with this? I'm, I'm trying to even imagine. Well, when I was young, around 16, we used to kidnap each other as a joke. And then it, slowly I started thinking, uh, what if it was a service? You little well, entrepreneur, you. Yeah. What type of service does it provide, though? It, it actually is rather scary. And do you yeah. do anything to her when, after you I mean, No, married? actually, I took her to her beach house. So. That was it? Yeah. So, but she didn't give you a motive. I thought you had to interview these people yeah, to make I sure they're not really on the edge and crazy and they're going to... Right. I always interview them. Uh, sometimes it's a week to a few days interview. It's, they have to trust me, so I yeah. develop a trust. If I ask you to kidnap me, can I get to the Hamptons faster? Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll do that. So, so Brock, now, now legally, do you have them sign documents? Yeah, there's these waivers. I'm learning more and more mm. all about them. You need legal. to know more about it before you do it. They well, my, lawyers, my lawyers, they're the ones teach me everything. You know, my ex-husband kidnapped me once. I mean, if you do it as a fun thing, because we were living up in Providence and I was teaching school, and he just uh, packed the car, and the next thing I know, I was in Quebec City. Did he, did he tie you up? No. You, oh. Down girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. But, but I mean, I see the point of it as a romantic gesture, but for a stranger to do it, I think it's weird. But it's to get over your fears. I was reading that you can put them in a room filled with frogs, right? If they're scared, if of, they're frogs. If they're scared of frogs. Or that, uh, uh, I guess, someone who doesn't like small spaces, you could kidnap them and put them into a small, dark space mm -hmm. to get over their fears. And yeah. Is yeah. that the service that you provide? Yeah, I mean, those are th some things that we have done. Sometimes it just, they want the kidnapping and that's all. They only but like the what, kidnapping. Just for the thrill of it? Or? Yeah. More... And the frogs, do you deal with warts also? Uh, <laughs> I can do that. What if they start, what if they start, the people actually start to freak out and become terrified? There's, there's, do you let them go? There's a code word and it's usually a break word and I determined that was the common. It's oh, okay. sexual. So they, you know, because well, that's what happens now? in Wait those sex games, that yes. you have a code word, not that I know, <laughs> but that you have a code word. That baby yeah, may I, be I, coming exactly. sooner than you think. You better use it or you're going to have a baby. Put <laughs> it away, you frog. Okay. Now, set it up for us, Brock. How does it happen? Um, well, I surveil the client for, let's say, a week. Well, I give them a, a window of opportunity. And one, one day, <clears throat> it'll happen. And they don't know which day. Okay. Oh, it's a totally sexual. And then, it's totally uh, sexual. It's walk. like a surprise attack. A place. That didn't and look sexual to me. That tape. Okay, okay, people people have, 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 have a thrill-seeking personality. Go, Go ahead. ahead. Rock, what happens and, then? and then, um, <laughs> from there, uh, I find the most vulnerable moment in their life, and then I kidnap them. Okay, and tell then, me sometimes when you kidnap people, like they're it, sleeping. Yeah, sleeping is a lot. Is the vulnerable. most popular one. So you have keys to homes. Yeah, they give me full access to their life. Every cars. Everywhere. So they have to develop a trust with me in the beginning. That's what the interview process is. Who the hell are you? I need to give you my name. Who the hell are you? He works it out with that. But they're usually, they're usually already aware of my work. They're, I mean, this is all in word of mouth. This is my first time. His reputation precedes him as a kidnapper. So it's $1,500 to do it? Well, now, yeah, it's been going. Like, for example, because it starts at 1500 It starts at 1500 because expensive. It's pretty expensive. Sure. I have a lot of people working Between the bag over the head, <laughs> that cost. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> well, it's, it's You're a, a nut, it's, it's you know a, that? It's a, it's a Prada bag I use. Oh, you so. use a Prada bag? <laughs> so you have to the money right there. Yeah, you, you, got you, you got it. Brock, do you actually take part in the kidnapping? No, no, I'm, I film, I work, and I'm on the phone all the time. So the why radio. are you videotaping it? For my movies. For your movies? If you put them in movies? No, you? well, I make these videos out of them. Like. So when you look you at You want to have a Fox TV special, I know it. Oh, let's Pretty soon we're so going to see it on Fox. Let me ask you something. They pay you for you to have a movie. You should be paying them. No, they, I, they pay me for, for the, the experience. experience. 
Well, they're actors, basically. Some some clients don't want don't get don't release the rights uh -huh. for the video, so I they just take I make them their video, and then they take it home. Do you and, you've interviewed a lot of people? Do you, do you think we're good candidates for kidnapping? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Why? What I makes mean, us? Because you're curious about it. No, we're not. We're well, not that not? curious. Okay. Well, then, well, then, you, then I don't know. There have been a lot of abductions reporting of little right. kids, and actually, one of the, I was yeah. talking to this woman today who said that her kid would always wander off, and she, she always said to him, one of these days you're going to get kidnapped, and she actually entertained the idea of doing it to scare the kid, which oh I don't think God. is a good, Let's which I don't do think that. is a good idea. Don't no, no, I know, I know, but I don't know if you've ever encountered anything like that. Where do you work out of? New York? Yes. All right. So if anybody wants to be kidnapped, contact Brock Enright. Our thanks to Brock. Thank He'll you so much. He'll be on America's Most Wanted All before right. you know it. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. You know what? Yeah. I don't... Yeah. Before we go, it's, it's Tracy, right? Was it great, Tracy? Tracy, what's your boyfriend's name? Troy? Tracy and Troy, good luck. Thanks for playing along with us. Is Have she a great... still a virgin? Ask her. You still a virgin? <laughs> Leave her alone. <laughs> Thanks, Brock. We'll be right back. I hope he hasn't been kidnapped. We'll be right back with Fred Savage. <laughs>